Hello everyone, this is Joyce, the Cookie Lady. Welcome to my channel today. If you're new, welcome. I'm so glad you stopped by to spend time with me today. Uh, returning uh, subscribers, thank you for staying with me. Um, today, I'm going to be frying some pork chops with onion gravy. So, stick with me and let's get started. Okay, I'm going to turn my, get my oil heated up while I season my pork chop. Okay, my oil is heated up, so now I've got my pork chops seasoned and floured. I'm just gonna lay it in the pan. Uh, could heat up a little bit more. But that's okay. It'll work. <laughs> I got my last pork chop in the pan here. And uh, I've got these two ready. <laughs> and get this last one brown the way I like it. And then we're going to make some gravy for these pork chops. So hang in there. I'll be right back. Okay, I poured off the grease from the from the pork chop. And now I'm going to take my flour that was up. These dripping, these bits and pieces from the pork chop, you, you wanna leave all of that in there. That helps with the gravy. So we're just gonna, the flour that was left from flour in the pork chop. Put that in there. And then we're going to let this flour brown. I always keep it moving because I don't want my flour to burn. Don't worry about that. There's not a lot of grease in the, in the center. I don't care about that. It's going to brown up nicely. You'll see. I don't like a lot of grease uh, on mine. So... That's why there's a lot, a lot of grease there. Get that brown. I think I'll use the spoon instead. See how dark that's getting? That's what you want. Now, you can put your onions in right now. But what I like to do is put my, my meat in first, and then I lay my onions on top for around the sides of it. See? See how brown that flour has gotten now? Gravy is real simple. As I said before, for me, cooking is one of the simplest and easiest things to do around the house. Now, I'm just gonna take my pork chops and lay them back in the pan. I'm only gonna do two. I'm not gonna do all three in the gravy. Then, I'll take my onion, already chopped up. You can cut your onions however which way you want to cut it. If you want to dice it, that's totally up to you. Now, get all of that goodness off of there. Don't worry about it, it's not gonna burn. Now we're gonna take some water, get my lid ready. Pour a little water, let that initial steam, steam. And then, I will pour more water. Don't no worry that you're gonna get too much water. It's not gonna to be too much. Now, take that off. Gonna get that water underneath there. Those onions down in there, water.
and you want to let them cook until the onions are nice and tender. So we're just going to cover this now and let it cook. Now, after in a, in a minute, you taste it to see if you need to add some more salt or any other seasonings. But with the salt that you use in the, the making, you know, seasoning the chops, you may not even need any extra uh, salt or other seasonings in it. See how it's thickening up? Look at that. That's going to be a beautiful gravy. All right. So now, turn my handle this way. Cover it. Well, before I do, I'm going to add a little more water. You can't put too much water because as it cooks, it's going to, the flour is going to thicken and it's going to be, um, it'll be, it'll be just fine. So, now, I'm going to leave that, cover it, and let it continue to cook. And I will be back later to show you the gravy for our pork chops. Okay? Stay with me. I'll be back. All right. Let's take a look at this. Look at that. Now, you'll need to flip your, your pork chops periodically so that it can be coated on both sides evenly. So you're going to need to flip that. Be careful because they're getting tender, more tender as they cook. So let me just show you a little closer. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. I'm telling you, pork chops with... Uh, onion gravy, see the onions are just about translucent. So just keep an eye on it. Turn your, your heat down on medium. Mine is done five uh, on this electric stove. So, and just let it cook. Keep it covered. All right. Well, here we have it. Smothered pork chop served over mashed potatoes and biscuits. Now I like my gravy a little lumpy. I don't care for that smooth uh, gravy. I like a little little stuff <laughs> in my gravy. So if you don't like that like that, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know how to tell you to smooth it out. So but try it with the lumps. You'll like it. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Share. Subscribe if you have not. Put, turn on that notification bell so that my next video you will not miss. Stick with me and I will see you in the next one.